It's uh, Wednesday, April 24th. I'm down in Bighorn Sheep Canyon. I'm rattling the bushes and kicking out some caddisflies. I'm about three miles below Salida, and uh, the river flow is about 380, 380 cubic feet per second this morning. It's uh, tinted olive, but as you can see, it's plenty of visibility out there. There are some caddis clear up here in the bushes where the main body of the caddis hatch is probably more down in that kind of Coaldale, Cotopaxi area, easing up into Howard. These warm days we've been having are really uh, warming the river water and resulting in uh, caddis hatch progressing upstream at a pretty good clip. It's a little further upstream maybe today than we normally expect on April 24th, but it'll ebb and flow uh, depending on cloud cover or sun, air temperature, and ultimately water temperature is the real driver for that hatch. We also have great blooming olive activity going on in the afternoons, and I just drove through um, quite a midge hatch making my way down to this spot in the canyon. The, um, the weather looks really quite good over the next few weeks. And what I mean by that is we got some warm days that are really gonna crank this hatch up. And then we have some cooler days that are gonna um, temper that and allow for um, whatever snow melt we may see come in. Uh, that'll be, you know, depressed or slowed down by uh, intervening cooler days with the result being, I think, we pretty stable conditions projected over the next two weeks here in the upper Arkansas. And um, great hatches, particularly that caddis hatch, as the uh, water temperature gets warmer and warmer, both here and upstream. If you want more information about fishing on the Arkansas River or the caddis hatch in particular, we'll be updating our website very frequently at this time of year, keeping you apprised of what's going on. That's arcanglers.com. You can, of course, call us at 719 Five three nine four two two three, or stop in our fly shops in uh, Salida and Buena Vista.